try using the cup at mini washing machine 26 pounds all right we're going to try washing a twin bed sheet and pillowcase all right go ahead and put the pillow go ahead and put it in all right Let's see how big it is in there after that there's still all kinds of room all right i'm going to go ahead and put some a little bit just a tiny bit on there and then we're going to add the water to the fill line there is a fill line for one small medium and large and we're just going to squirt just a little bit in there it's kind of high there we go couldn't see it all right we're going to turn on the water it is kind of leaky not a real sturdy hose use their clamp Supposed to be filling up. I don't know where it's filling up at. Should be looking on the floor. He's using the one on the right side instead of the one on the left side. So hopefully it's filling up oh, on. Turn it off. Turn it off. Yep, it's leaking everywhere. So it is. It's going all over the floor, out the side, because we probably turned the drain on. Okay, part two. Yep, now we're filling it. So. What happened was the hose was laying on the floor, but now that it's picked up... It's hooked. Yeah. Good. So, not gravity falling out, but this one comes with the uh, semiotic pump. Turn on the hot water. Ooh, hot hot one. Oh, that's right. Hot water would be good. Let's try some hot water. See what it feels like. But I've got this all the way up. It was partially up, it's barely coming out. That's not bad, but it is a standard nozzle. But there is a lot of room in there. You can see the bottom. I think it's such a small load. You'd like I could throw your towel in there. No, I'd rather for our first load just do the small one just to be sure we're okay and no more leaks. Actually, I think I'm standing in a little bit of water. This is the one that comes with the little bit longer hoses. There were complaints with the earlier models. And this isn't very long. No, it's not long, and I know they sell the extenders, but this and the isn't. Cord isn't very long. Yeah, I can't remember how long it said the cord is. That's like, like four six feet? feet, six feet, six yeah. feet. Okay, that doesn't look like six feet. Oh. I'm five feet, and that's shorter than me, so that can't be that long. But since it's it's got the 26 pound capacity, but since our shower is so tall, two feet, 18 inches. Yeah. We decided not to lift it into the shower. We're going to go ahead and just let it run into the bathroom when we're done. Toilet. Sorry, toilet. Okay, so how much water do you think it needs? Since it's small, and for the small, it says to put it down here. Oh, that's some warm water. Probably. We're pretty close. To the, uh, Right here for low yeah just go to there and then stop yeah okay i could probably throw in the hand help oh we can throw in your towel if you want nah okay. oh that's that's such a heavy that's the whole purpose of it is that we're still doing okay over here we do have some dripping it was in the shower we i've heard we can fill it up with the shower head Okay, we're just about there. And then we'll do a uh, gentle. Uh, we definitely don't need the full 15 minutes. It's got a 15 minute wash. So we'll do the, people do either usually the three or the six. The heavier is for the nine, 12, or 15. And the same with the type of wash, normal or gentle. Okay, we turn off the water. 
He's gonna close the lid. Sounds like we scared the dog. And then we turn it down. That's interesting. Oh, and then it goes the opposite way. So here, I guess I should do a little peek. So you can see how it washes. How aggressive it is. That's pretty good for the little soap. We used to do gel soap that we picked up in Paris while we were on vacation. We'll come back after that is finished in six minutes. Okay, so now it turned off. Water in there. I'm gonna turn it to, wow, to drain. And it should be coming out. We have to get up to the toilet. Coming out pretty good, wow. No, it mentioned in the directions, it mentioned push down, no, to push down on your clothes. Oh, but we're going to rinse it anyway. Mm-hmm. Get the, the extra water out to push down on them. Oh. See the dirty water in there. If they turn it off, or get ready to turn There's it There's still a lot of water in there, look. Okay. Right. I was just wondering, how does it know when not to pump or do you have to just keep it I don't know. And I definitely see a little bit of soap on there. Definitely needs another drain. I'm getting ready to turn it back. Yeah. That looks like it's not coming out. Oh, it is dirty. It is coming out a little. Okay, it's getting closer. Okay, it's getting pretty close. All right. Close your lid. Close this thing down because it's open either. Don't All right. do that. Now, fill it back. back. Go ahead, turn it on. Don't use hot water. Rinse, it, use rinse hot it off water. with cool water? Yeah. Okay. So, and we're going to yep. wash it off yep. one more time. We're putting in a little bit. Oh, right. Put your hose back up so it won't drain out. Putting your hose back on the hook so the gravity won't force it out. Yeah. I don't think we need to have as much water in, do you? Well, we need to just got to have more than that. It all depends on how mm -hmm. sensitive you are to your stuff. Checking to see if it was all twisted up, but not so much. Somebody uh, complained about their clothes being twisted up, so I was just checking, but it's really not that bad. You can always buy that. There's an extension that covers it better, but this isn't that bad. Just a little bit of water dripping out. All right, we'll do a rinse, and then we'll be back. Okay. So now we just did a second wash and we are ready for the drain, second drain, to wash it out. There we go. Sounds like a decent motor for the draining. You just have to make sure that you turn it off. Right, don't burn it out? Yeah, I mean, so then when it gets wait till just... it's all sucked out and then turn it off. Okay. And then wouldn't the gravity do the rest though if it was... Well, what you'll do is we'll go ahead and do that, then turn it off. Okay. And you can turn it off now. 
All right, because I can see it's out of there. My hands Just are kind of. Right all right. And then, and then it's said to like squish out right. any oh, extra say, water. You can oh. Squish out, or you could let it. Just sit there and drain out okay. for five minutes. But. Then you take this out. Oh, and I see a few spots of water. That may have been from us. And I'm going to pick this up, put it in there. And our, oh, I'm going to squeeze it just because I don't like all that. Because it's sitting down there in that leftover water. My own fault. And then this is half the size. Okay, of that. so now before so you turn this, that on. This holds, hold on, this holds, uh, I gotta go back and check, I think it's 18 pounds, and this holds like eight or something, and then you're supposed to push this down all the way. All right, Matt has words of wisdom. Yes, Matt. So before you turn that on, go ahead and turn your pump, your drain back on. Okay, so that way you can right just finish draining this out. Okay, I'm not allowed to spin until you're finished draining. Well, you can't, I'm just saying, no, you can't, it's not allowed in the direction, so. Right. Alright, so Matt would like to finish draining before I spin. We're still draining up, you know, part of the water. Yeah, so we probably should have done that before we moved it over. Alright, that's good. Drain it anyway. Okay. Alright, we'll finish that after. Alright, now my understanding is... 30 minutes? It was a little noisy at first, and now it is very quieted down. Very quiet. Yeah, it is spinning very quickly, and look at all the water coming out. So the pump is still pumping. Yeah, yeah. The pump is still going. That's good. I guess it's meant to run. We left it on the styrofoam, so it's not flat on the ground. But it looks pretty good. And you can't leave this open and spin at the same time, so we can't see what it's doing in there. But uh, we'll come back in a few minutes and see how it's done. Okay, it is shutting down. Okay, wait for it to stop. I can see it's still spinning. Look at this. Not bad. Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, it is. Ooh, same with that. That's not bad at all. I am actually pretty impressed. This is just like our washing machine, our big washing machine. Because I mean, like we bought this to go field. for our camper. Wow. And you can hang dry. Or put it in your washer. A or dryer. dryer, which put we your dryer. in your dryer. And um or they also make a dryer as well. Okay. Well, do they smell nice? Does it smell like a well? I, I think I've nice. actually I bought I think this is odor free. Yeah, I did. I bought it because I have sensitive skin, so that actually won't help anything. But anyway, um I would say I'd give it an A plus. It worked great. Um so far. Yep. So thanks for watching.